All right, everybody. Oh, uh, hi. <laughs> we it's weird looking at something. Yeah, you have to look at the camera. So we're here doing I look at the microphone. <laughs> doing a type of a podcast. I don't know what gave us this idea. We were just kind of brainstorming stuff, and we decided let's uh, do a podcast where we just talk. Yeah, we're trying to do other stuff. Yeah, you know, expand our horizons. Yeah. It's like um, diversifying your portfolio. It's like new horizons. <laughs> yeah. Speaking. Okay, so. The kind of the idea we thought about going off of was just like Reddit and then kind of reading news off of Reddit. So here we are on the Nintendo Switch subreddit right now. Do you now. read it on Reddit? <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard that one before. All right, so yeah. we plan on kind of doing this like as a weekly type thing. Um, so we figured we'd go to like certain subreddits, specifically the Nintendo Switch one and then the uh, the gaming one. And then a third one will be just kind of whatever we kind of topic we want to talk yeah. about right now. This Something time we'll do Animal Crossing. Do a video game. You can so tell I'm doing, nervous. I'm flipping my phone. We're doing the top. Oh yeah, it always helps me like to like fidget or something. If I just like if I have like a pen in my hand or something like this or no clippers. Yeah, but like when I'm nervous, I will drop it because I like, uh, I'm like fidgeting with so it, and then all of a sudden I'm. Why did you drop like your that. phone three times yesterday? <laughs> Were you nervous about oh, no. Stardew Valley? <laughs> no. That w the first time, it was on my lap, and I forgot it was on my lap. So I stood up and it just fell. And then all the other times, it was sitting on the couch next to me, and then I moved and knocked it over. <laughs> Alright, so, the idea is we're going to read the top, like, I don't know, can you do, anyways, we'll just do like the top, I don't know, 10, 5, 10, however many, um, post on each uh, subreddit, each of the three subreddits we're covering that day. And then kind of discuss them. Um, so we're being very unoriginal, not coming up with our own stuff and just using other people's stuff that they grow. <laughs> and that's how we do it. Thanks, All people. Right. <laughs> so the first, obviously, we talked about this one because this was like a post from today. Um, but uh, it's gone now. I can't read it. Okay. <laughs> is really missing a huge opportunity by not porting GameCube games over to the Switch. This is by uh, Reddit user Zarsky843. Oh, we, we don't have to say his name every time they can read. Yeah. Um, that won't go away. <laughs> He's invading <laughs> our, our podcast. So GameCube was the second lowest selling console only behind the Wii U. Did you know that? Yes. I actually didn't know off the top of my head. I knew it didn't sell as well as like I thought it did. Because um, I played the heck out of the GameCube and it seemed like everybody I knew had the GameCube. Um, the only game I liked on that was Super Mario Sunshine. Um, it had a really, it had a ton of really high caliber exclusive games that tons of people have never played. Now that we have a portable system fully capable of playing the entire GameCube library, this would be a perfect time to introduce these games to a wider audience. But what do I know? Um, yeah, I kind of agree. Um, what about you? I have mixed opinions. <laughs> yeah and no. Why no? No, mostly because, I don't know, I don't feel like they would, because, like, not many people liked it at all. The GameCube? Yeah. I don't know if that's true. I love the GameCube. Well, and I'm the only person that exists, so. it, <laughs> My opinion. It, it's the it's second the lowest selling console. <laughs> yeah, but that doesn't necessarily mean it's bad or people didn't like it. Um, yeah, but, like, the PlayStation not, 2. I feel like Nintendo won't do it. Because nobody really wanted it. Um, and then, yes, also because if they... They might do it because there are some games that people like. Like Super Mario Sunshine. Super Mario Sunshine. Smash Bros. Melee. Yeah. There's Melee a, is there's still a lot super of, popular. Yeah. Pikmin. Um, Wind Waker. A lot of games that were only on the GameCube one. And GameCube like, has a ton they, of good games. Let's go yeah. to uh, Metacritic. Top GameCube games. Metacritic. This is what it's cool having um, the laptop here. Metroid Prime, huge. Resident Evil Force, not a Nintendo exclusive, I don't think, so I can't really use that. Twilight Princess, I forgot about that, was on the GameCube. Oh, yeah. Wind Waker is on the GameCube. Jeez. I, was, um, I, was. I need an ad blocker. <laughs> Madden <laughs> NFL 2004. 94. Soul Calibur, I've never cared for those. Beautiful Joe, I never played that. Um. Eternal Darkness, SXX, Madden, see Super Smash Bros., Super Mario Sunshine, Prince of Persia, that was a fun game. Also not a Nintendo exclusive, but Metroid Prime 2, mm -hmm. uh, THPS uh, 4, Resident Evil, uh, what is this? 
Oh, Master uh, Quest to Ocarina of Time? Yeah, okay. Star Wars Rogue Leader, NBA 2K2. Pikmin 2 is very popular. So there were some... Uh, Pikmin 2... Or Pikmin. Pikmin also. <laughs> Pikmin 1 also. <laughs> F-Zero. So, just... I mean, even... I mean, a lot of these aren't Nintendo exclusives and they're on other consoles, but... Yeah. Uh, but it still did... The mainline game, and even like, the, well, there's Super Monkey Ball, even like, um, yeah, there's Paper Mario, Thousand Year Girl, Mario Kart, Double Dash, Animal Crossing. Yeah, there's a lot of games that. These are, like, we're scrolling down pretty far, and we're just in the 87s. If a game gets a review of an 87, I'd say that's a pretty good game. Imagine if they put, like, GameCube games on the Switch, and then they put, like, the old Animal Crossing on there. They'll have two Animal Crossings on the Switch. Yeah. That'd be crazy. The that Sims, be. the very first Sims. <laughs> Um, but anyways, that's that. Um, Did anybody but, ever play that? I'm trying. See, I would personally, from my perspective, as a person who plays video games, I would love having GameCube games on the Switch. I mean, the more the merrier. I would never say no to that. I would yeah. never say don't put these games that I love on the Switch because that would be just silly. But would they do it is a different question. Like they're going through right now with the Nintendo Switch Online thing. Yeah. And they're adding, like, they have the, the NES games, and then they have the SNES games now. What's next? Probably Game Boy, and then maybe, I don't know if they can lump Game Boy Advance and Game Boy in together. I feel like they would just go up the chain. And then N64, and then GameCube. But they do one every year at the rate they've currently been going in, so that would be quite a while before GameCube and the new Nintendo console. But who knows, they might, not, they might not do one this year. Yeah, cause, because you know, there's all, all, all around. Nobody really knows. We haven't had a direct in like almost a year now. Like a real direct. Yeah, with these we'll have just minis. And mostly about like certain How games. many? <laughs> um, so, <laughs> yeah, never realized the GameCube was so <laughs> well sold. This is my <laughs> first console that got me into gaming. Which that's true for me too. Like... Arguably, the Nintendo 64 had an impact, too, because that was my first console I owned. But the GameCube... <laughs> what? Okay, so I was thinking, my first console was a PS2. And then I was reading, oh, the PS2 yeah. is done. Everyone had a PS2 because it was a DVD player. That's part, uh, That could be part of the reason why the GameCube didn't. So, yeah, I never... Uh, I always found it weird because growing up, it seemed like literally everyone had one. But, yeah, PS2 sold, like, crazy. Yeah. Because um, it had a DVD player in it, too. Mm -hmm. At that time, DVD players were still fairly new. Yeah. So the fact that it had one like built into it was pretty cool. Mm -hmm. So that kind of swayed a lot of people that way. Um, plus, the PlayStation 1 was a pretty big success, and everybody had a lot of fun with that. Um, I didn't realize until recently how old the PlayStation 1 was. I think it came out like, 99. Whoa. Um, yeah. Uh, is that old? Uh... Just 2000. PlayStation. Um, not PlayStation. Oh, even, even 1995. See, that's what I'm saying. Even now that I know it came out before I thought it did, it still came out even earlier than I thought it did. <laughs> 1995. That's the year Riley, Riley was born. Wow. He's 25 years old. He's 25. That game came out a couple Just months kidding, after he was born. I know how old he is. You're 28. <laughs> Shh, stop giving that away. He gave Riley's away, so why not? <laughs> two megabytes of RAM. It's crazy to think like that was considered impressive back then. But look, this laptop I have is like 12 gigabytes. Gigabyte <laughs> it doesn't. Oh. It's not like yours. Um, so I think we just got didn't get rid of the sticker. You probably got rid of yours. No, I didn't. I would have. Kept that on. Oh, Alright, what else we got here? Okay, that's a promoted one. That's an ad. Disney Plus. <laughs> Nintendo is removing uh, Animal Crossing New Horizons <laughs> items that have hacked or cheated items because a YouTuber is reporting them in his videos. Why is he reporting them? I don't know. Why is it harming him? Okay, no hate speech or personal attacks or harassment. So don't say anything mean. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm saying it's a publicity stunt. Um, yeah, I mean, why does he care? It's not mm -hmm. hurting, it's not a competitive game. <laughs> it's Animal Crossing. You just play yeah. on your own. He <laughs> cheated. I, I don't like this. Yeah. How can you do this cool thing from hacking and cheating? He hacked. Totally He's in 2024. Um, 
<laughs> time travelers. Okay, that's crossing the line. If you're time well, travel. <laughs> they have that option. You can do it. I know. If they didn't, they would like make it so that it couldn't. But um, there's the summer update. Oh, what's that thing? What the? What does he have on that? These? Yeah. I don't know. Just green spheres. <laughs> green spheres. I was gonna say balls, but you know, that could be taken out of context. So, but <laughs> so the summer update. We could talk about the summer update. We just actually had the fireworks today. Yeah. Um, how do you feel about fun. it? Uh, it was kind of annoying because they don't stop. Well, they go like all the way to midnight, to seven midnight. to midnight. But it's like after a while of me playing, I was just getting annoyed by the sound of pew pow. Yeah. So Tyler's getting annoyed by the firework sounds. Yes. Um, in a similar vein, I get really annoyed by shooting stars, and that seems to happen like a couple times a week. Um. Not to me. But it's one of those things where it feels like I have to do something every time I hear the ding. Like, it's like, oh, I had to look up and, you know, make a wish or whatever. We don't and they just keep have going. to. I know, but it's like one of those things where I feel like I'm missing out well, if I don't. Yeah. It's like, oh, I won't get the start well, like, I, I never, I never get them. It's like, I only get one, like, barely, like, once every month, it feels like. It might just be I don't play that much, maybe. Or <laughs> oh, I feel like I get them all the time. I feel like I don't get them at all. I feel like whenever I hear them, I'm like, oh, get as much as possible. I can't get, like... Okay. So, what else we got? Okay. Smash, this is a controversial... Well, it's not, it shouldn't be controversial. Uh, Smash Pro Streamer Zero has been banned from Twitch because he did some bad things. Um, I didn't know that. Yeah. Um, I guess I should pay atten more attention. Well, the Smash community is taking a pretty big hit right now. Because a lot of their uh, pro players are getting in trouble. Um, physical release of Stardew Valley is available available to pre-order now through Fan Game. We're almost at the cover art. Can website. we say why they were getting in trouble? We can, but it's a long, complicated topic. Okay. Because um, I don't know anything about it, so I was just wondering. And yeah. Do you, can you simplify it or no? Basically, uh, well, there's a lot of different things with a lot of different players, so. One doesn't all apply to all of them. Yeah, but like, what about zero? What was? I don't remember. Because okay. <laughs> I Whoa. didn't hear anything about that. Now you're just shopping. I think he was talking to an underage girl. Wow. So yeah, stuff like that. That is pretty cool. The cover art. It's not what I expected it would be. I wonder who designed that. No buying stuff in the middle of a podcast, right? No, I already have the game. <laughs> Whoa, look at that. Well, that's not just the game. Final product. I feel like you would buy that just for that. But, I mean, look just what it comes with in the pre order book. bonus. Like that. <laughs> the deed of land you can. <laughs> it's a pre order? Yeah, because this is a physical edition. They don't have a physical mm. edition right now. So, what is this? Is this like. Buy the physical a edition box for the box? Or this is probably just... No, this is the box that just includes everything. Probably. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. That's cool. Um, I'm almost out of water, of course. Yeah, you're going to dehydrate. Uh, percent of five. Uh, no toads were harmed in the making of the video. What? <laughs> oh, are they coming out with actual, like, origami toads you can fold up? What happened? What happened? Uh, oh no. Oh. We missed some of it. My, my stream ended. My capture. Alright guys, we're back. It's because I opened it in full screen and it's... So we just have to watch it here. That's fine, I don't care. Hopefully it's saved. Oh. oh it's like the bug. It's a little yeah, it's a cicada. I haven't played the Origami King, so I don't really know. Maybe it's really fun. Um, What's he? I don't remember. Do, does like each color have like a certain meaning? No. No. I don't know why they're different colors in the game. Maybe they do and I just haven't noticed. That looks like... Swan. That's what I said. Was it Desi? 
that's cool. <laughs> he just fell in the water and swam away. Um, no, I don't want to go there. All right. Go where? To that Push page. Gardens? Uh, Nintendo Repair Center lost his console. That sucks. Did he find it? to get back? That's why I see I got the uh, Joy-Con Drift on mine. And I want to send it in to, for repairs, but I'm afraid like something's going to happen. Mm -hmm. um, do we have an update? Uh, just contacted. Switch came and it still has its data. I made a tweet so you can see. Okay, cool. So, uh, so apparently he got it. He got everything back with his all his data and everything. And somehow Reddit helped, I guess. Probably. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Um, because that would suck to lose your switch. No, no. And lose all your stuff. Cause I mean they got saved data back up, but you know. Mm -hmm. Doesn't work for every game. I wonder if oh, yeah. if that happened before the data backup was on Animal Crossing too. Yeah, that's a good question. Well, I mean, he got it back regardless. Yeah, that's a good question. Um, Pokemon Tournament DX uh, free to play week. I wonder if that's going on right now because I kind of want to play that. What? You ever played Pokemon Tournament? I feel like we played it once, I like the demo. Yeah, I think we it's played kind of just like a. Sh okay. Yeah. Well, that was posted two days ago, so it's probably free to play right now. Which case we should probably play. Can't tonight. Yeah, can't tonight. Maybe we'll play that while Wyatt's down here. Um, <laughs> yeah, get Wyatt to play. Yeah, it is the update. Alright, we can switch over to gaming now, which I think is mostly going to be, be uh, memes. Um, probably. <laughs> um, so, the top uh, gaming memes of this week, according to. Um, Reddit to gaming. What is Top this? memes. Yeah. Alright, what do we got here? Wait, let's read the title first. Okay, it's stuck between a rock and a hard place. Jeez! <laughs> I don't think he's gonna survive that. Is that, is this the, um, is that the, the game everybody's talking about, Ghost of Tsushima or whatever? Probably. It looks like it. Jeez, he's just getting walloped. <laughs> I like the dude under him, like, I got him, I got him, I got him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with the spear. <laughs> Jesus, H. Macy, those are the best archers the world has ever seen. <laughs> nice. Um, that's an ad. Play Mario Paint for the first time. I want to play this. I've never played Mario Paint. Sounds weird. Yay. There are a lot of weird Super Nintendo. There's one called uh, Mario's Time Machine, and I have played it after watching the Game Grumps play it, and it was actually pretty fun. If you like history, um, you should like Alexander Hamilton. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> By the way, guys, if you haven't seen Hamilton, check it out. It's pretty good. I actually liked it. I didn't think I would, but I liked it. I didn't know you were into musicals. Uh, I mean, I'm not, not into them. Yeah, but like... Wait a second. I you drew that. Yeah. Wow. I thought that was just like the title screen or something. I can kind of tell by it's the paint. All, wait, it's all been Mario Paint. Always has mm -hmm. been. Oh, that's cool. It's mm -hmm. really well done. I've seen, but I don't. I've never played the game, so I don't know how difficult. I mean, I like how it looks like a computer with like the. Yeah. Yeah. There. I mean, there were. There was another. Oh my gosh! I think there's there another like odd Mario game. Kind of God game. Mario. Game. Odd Mario game. Oh, I thought you said God. Yeah, that aerial <laughs> video of a Minecraft city. Could you imagine how long that take? I wonder the. Dude, there's this one guy going around building like the whole world in Minecraft. Really? Yeah. Oh, also the map is green filled. Like every single city. In five people. Every single. Started back in August of 2011. So six. About six of those. Nine. Okay, so it's nine. Yeah. And he's mm -hmm. been with them for six years. Jeez, could you imagine working on the same place in Minecraft, like the same city, mm -hmm. for nine years? 2011. When did Minecraft come out? It was around that time, right? It was. I mean, there was like a, the beta came out like a long time before. Yeah, um, beta was out for a very long time. Yeah. Okay, so November 11th, November 18th, 2011. Well, so they probably started playing as soon as it came out. Yeah, I mean. And that's when they. The game really 
didn't have that much stuff that you can build. Like, textures didn't really look like cities. That, like, anything that you could build a city. Yeah. You couldn't go underground. Uh, I don't think you can go underground. I don't, I'm not sure. I don't remember the first thing. I've only watched a video of somebody come. So May 17, 2009 okay. is apparently when it came out. So at least the beta. Like the Wikipedia lied. Well, I think that's, see, that's the but official But I think that's release. for the beta. Uh, yeah. That's what it seems to be. Um, that's why a lot of people, when they were doing, like, top video games of the last decade, of the 2010s. Mine. It's like, what? do we count Minecraft? Did it come out in 2011 or did it come out in 2009? Would it be in the 2000s decade? Um, either way. What would it be? Yeah, I think it had its most impact in the 2010s. Yeah. Because that's when everybody was playing. Yeah, because it wasn't just a beta and everything. Yeah. It was like an actual game that was out now. Jokingly well, used the ring from Dishonored 2 to propose to my girlfriend on a few occasions this time. There's a real one underneath. Wish me luck. Oh, that was posted two days ago. Let's see how it went. Do you think she said yes? Uh-huh. You're still together after a few fake proposals. I mean, she's a keeper. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> True. Right, if he just pops that out. <laughs> I gets her hopes off. It's like, yeah. I need an update, OP. Give me an update. Update! She cried right uh, uh, oh, you, gotta find the, you gotta find the blue text. Yeah, we'll need an update. Hope the update is top comment. I'll copy it for Curry. So it worked. Took her up to the roof of the apartment block to watch the sea and the sunset. Wow. You can see the sea and the sunset from his apartment. Wow. I brought up the disordered box and opened it and she laughed told me to stop teasing her looked away. She turned back. I was on one knee and the real ring was in place. A lot of loud high pitched excited noise later. She said yes. So yeah, I'm getting married. Cool. That's Congrats, man. Like, Stop. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. I love it. Well, I told my grandpa not to give me anything for my birthday, so he got me a Pac Man arcade machine with seven games. I told him to give you nothing and he gives you something? <laughs> So, uh, it's, nothing is not a valid answer for grandparents. <laughs> grandpa of the year. I'm not sure it's giving the man enough credit. Literally got the opposite of what he asked for, though. Yeah, Grandpa did listen. They never listen when you tell them not to give you anything. Tell them not to give me something. Tell them not to give me anything for my birthday either, bro. <laughs> Grandpa spent 700 on Galaga one quarter at a time in 1982. <laughs> cool. My dad loves Galaga. That's like one of his games. Mm-hmm. Sad reality of being trash <laughs> at games when you get a decent computer, so you can't blame it, and you have to accept your trash. <laughs> I just love the cat. <laughs> Cuphead on a 1964 Magnavox Color Roundy. Wow. <laughs> we need to play Cuphead. Do you think we can handle Cuphead? No. I don't think so either. I don't like hard games. See, when you think of Cuphead, you think it would just be like a easy, like, kid-friendly game, just, but it's like super hard. <laughs> what the heck? He's vibing, dude. <laughs> I don't know what that happened, though. Uh, beats me. Just don't question it, man. Just accept. <laughs> I just don't know how to do that in the game. Look at my horse. My horse is amazing. Probably a reference to something I don't understand. <laughs> yeah, oh my god, I'm so old. Um, yeah. It's, uh, why does this feel like watching a high rule word? I can't even say that. A high rule wood movie. Is there a sound to this? High rule wood movie? High rule word, yeah. Just seeing if I could pronounce it. Yeah, you got it. Way to show me up. <laughs> I wasn't <laughs> trying to. I was just seeing if I could pronounce it. Cause you're out, right? I wish this was like 10 times Can longer. I? <laughs> James <laughs> Baxter. Um, nobody's Breath saying. The... Well, that was wild. What a finger! I hate that. <laughs> All right, James Baxter. Everybody saying James Baxter. Let's look this up. He's an animator. James Bond. British. Oh, James Baxter, the horse. That's probably what we need. Oh, it's Adventure Time. 
Oh. I've only watched that once, and I was like, nope. Oh. Uh, see, I never went out of my way to watch it, but every time I watched it, I was like, this is kind of cool. I enjoyed it. Um, it was pretty popular. No. Reception. Oh, let's uh, look up the reception. Well, let's look up the reception of James Baxter Wars. <laughs> Making it the top rated Cartoon Network series during the week of May 6th, 2012, <laughs> in 2013. 1.4 Nielsen household rating. Alright, so whatever. Alright, Adventure Time. I like how this is gaming stuff, and now we're heads up. Well, we don't want to put ourselves on a track and stay on the track, man. We've got to go off the rails yeah. every now and then. That's what the people want. True. Received positive reviews from critics. So it looks like you're wrong for your opinion, Tyler. You can't have a different opinion than the critics. <laughs> a terrific show that fits beautifully. You don't like Fairly Odd Parents either. Yeah, I think you just have bad taste in cartoons. We should go to Animal Crossing now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, the game when I'm alone. You just pet the dog in the game when my parents walk in and spike Nick in it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. two more which straight up. Yeah, that water does look pretty good for a 2002 game. Wow. You know more, what Morrowind is, right? No. It was... Um, it's in the Elder Scrolls series. Um. So it's like a prequel to Skyrim. Um... All right, the Animal Crossing subreddit, as requested by Tyler over here. We're spending too much time on gaming memes. Yeah. We have an um, intruder. Uh -oh. <gasps> We're doing a podcast, Mom. You want to say hi to the people? Hi, people. That's what you get for interrupting our podcast. Don't forget. I won't. <laughs> <laughs> Night, Mario and Luigi. <laughs> what about Snuffleupagus? Oh, didn't see him. I think you're blocking Mario anyway. <laughs> He's in the uh, the Mario universe now. <laughs> yeah, you're blocking. We're probably, you're probably okay. blocking both of them. So right. what you have uh, Mario and Luigi back there if you guys couldn't see him. We created the first episode of Avatar The Last Airbender. How did they get all this stuff? I, mean, I guess we'll find out in the uh, when it gets winter, winter. over here. <laughs> Winter time. I need to I need to get on uh, Avatar Last Airbender. I've watched it a little bit when I was a kid, but not a lot. But people who like it love Avatar. Um, it's an anime. Yes, I know. Okay. It's on Netflix now. So it got like... I feel like Netflix has a lot of anime. You know... What, it, what's your anime one? Hulu or... Well, Netflix? that's the thing. It used, Hulu used to be the place to go for anime other than like the primarily like anime centered ones like Kiss Anime and Crunchyroll and stuff like that. But now Netflix is like getting all But the Netflix other is ones. catching up. I mean Netflix no, right? Netflix has Pokemon. Now I feel like most of the anime is now on Netflix. Most people are going to Netflix for anime now. Well, anime's so. always had like stuff like Attack on Titan and some of the like super popular ones. But if you wanted like a wider selection I'm pretty sure Hulu was the one we'd go to. Hulu has Sailor Moon. I don't think Netflix does. Um, Netflix has always had Pokemon. Um, but like, if you want like the more like super like nerdy anime fan animes, you would obviously want to go to Crunchyroll or Kiss Anime. But Hulu was like like the popular thing that like people mostly had anyways, where they could watch a lot of anime. I got bored midway through that sentence. Sorry. So I, <laughs> and mostly it was reason because I started reading this. <laughs> yeah, he recreated his wheelchair in uh, New Horizons. I didn't know you could custom design like yeah. that. That's actually cool. Yeah. Uh, coming back from a five-star island on ec and and trying to fix your own like... <laughs> <laughs> what is that show called? Is that Pingu? I think so. I spelled it wrong. Yeah. Yeah, Pingu. <laughs> I remember that. Huh. 2006. Well, yeah, it but started That's in the when 80s. it ended, but. Mm -hmm. Ended the year I was born, of course. <laughs> Put it in reverse, Terry. <laughs> Put it in reverse, Terry! Put it in reverse! Oh, Lord! Lord, please! Oh, Lord! Oh, please! What you doing, Terry? Oh, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> My take on Island Tour with cars. No sound. 
And there's just gonna be some like pushing the park. Oh. <laughs> it's like stop motion. Okay. Hey, this gets people into stop motion. Can you imagine if you could just sleep while you, you were driving around, like in your life? That's a thing. If you get a Tesla. <laughs> yeah, once he's self driving. Hey, there's a no going across the road. <laughs> oh no. Oh. <laughs> Oh, okay. The in. one thing that I didn't like in that video was there was a there was a fossil that he didn't get. Yeah, I went to my. Did I tell you I went to my friend's island for the bug off? And like, I was going around, and she had so many undug up fossils, so many money trees that haven't been shaken yet. <laughs> and then like, I went to explore her house, and she didn't have a basement. I was like, "You can't afford a basement yet?" She's like, "No, I'm having financial hardships." Like, do your fossils, shake your money trees. You could probably pay with everything you had out there. You could probably pay off your basement. <laughs> My take on the outdoor pool takes up three design slots available yep. in all colors. See, I want the top one. I want the white one. But my uh, pool doesn't have the white around it. Yeah. I'd my have pool to get, is the gray. I'd have to get that yep. one. Yep. I have but it. I don't like the look well, of the I, gray. I made my own. It's not... I didn't download it. I wanted it to, but... I just felt like it might actually be easier to download it. Yeah, so if anybody watching this has this pool, send it to us. <laughs> let me know <laughs> because I want it, the white pool. Um, I will pay whatever you want if I have whatever you want. <laughs> um, so this I love. Tripping. The tripping and falling with the king. And there's Renee. Was well, it my Mom Renee or? My or Renee. Was, uh, the horse Renee. Yeah, our mom hates that Renee. Because it's sisterly. She doesn't like the sisterly ones. Yeah. 11 letters and so Best friend has 11 letters and so does backstabber. Tina, I got an empty spot beside me. Have a seat, stuffing. <laughs> I had hilarious. something almost, almost exactly like that happen to me. I'll try to remember to post it in like right here. <laughs> so it should be on the screen right now happening. On your uh, video screen, yeah. Where? I don't know. Where? Where? There. There. Somewhere around here. Or <laughs> just. Hey, it's like when people are like trying to point to the videos at the end, like, yeah. click this video, click this video. <laughs> it's like, it's like you're trying to figure out. Yeah. But when something happened to me like then, that. Then when YouTube used to have polls, it'd be like, go click this poll. No, which <laughs> side? Top right, top right, top left. I don't know. A fruit salad party. Why do they get rid of polls? What? I don't know. That's what I'm wondering. Did they? I didn't even... I mean, that's what I've heard. Rainbow cinnamon rolls? I haven't seen them recently, so... Look, they got cinnamon rolls for tails. Yes, no. Especially that one. What's Filbert? The blue one. Poppy. I love Poppy. I was got Blair? Blair, uh, not there. Ha, 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 ha. Blair's not there. Mine is, but yours isn't. It's all right. Yeah, on my little highlighter hat on. Whoa, that's really cool. Can you do that, Ron? No, I mean, no. I mean, I guess I could theoretically, but. Do you would, feel like you have that time? Uh, no, nor do I have the patience, really. Do you have. No, okay. Wait, let me rephrase that sentence. Okay. Do you have the time to get off the animal crossing? <laughs> Yeah, I have to stop playing Animal Crossing to build an Animal Crossing Lego <laughs> for the plot. But like, that would be fun, though. <laughs> you still in the Animal Crossing theme. But what oh. am I getting out of building that? Reddit Karma? Can no. I sell it? Uh, I mean, it looks cool. I can put it in my room, but if it falls it off the shelf, shelf. Yeah, but then it falls and it breaks and I have a mess and then I cry because my creation Has my shit. Lego thing in my room broke yet? I don't know. Wow. Okay, that's fantastic. Um, she's more owl than she is in the game, but yeah, but that's what it would look like. Really good. I know. This is you know, the Beatles. <laughs> oh, I love mm. that. <laughs> yeah, that's really funny. How they set like that, that up? Uh, they're like little figurines. He donated them to uh, a flick, probably. Just custom design. See, I really want my town to look something like that. Like an actual city? Yeah. Same. But I just don't, like, my, my, I can't ever picture that in my head to where. I'm, I'm. Such a simpleton, man. I'm picturing mine, like, 
it's like a city, but like it's just like a tiny town. There's, since there's no cars, you don't really need a road. Yeah. My road is mostly just a terracotta path and mm. some like stone and wood and everything. Uh, I Shopping just... centers are wood. The stone is for like um, the villagers and everything, and the terracotta is around the rest of the island. Yeah. And then there's dirt going to the campsite. I use that that path a lot and terracotta a lot. Yeah, I use terracotta a lot. I mostly use that for like something that like I just want that's different from something else because mm-hmm. I have like just the normal stone for my villagers and if I want to use stone I have to use that one because I don't want it to be the same I use that for um, I had to look closely at that because one of my friends uh, <laughs> their username and everything is PG Keen oh. so I was like well, uh, Come with, uh, <laughs> uh, it's a different oh. um, and that's just what I noticed first uh, <laughs> what the hell are y'all mad at Red for? Do you know how long it takes to steal the effing Mona Lisa? Right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hi, Favu. Are you maybe looking for a Mrs. Flamingo? <laughs> <laughs> She's proposing. <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. This is my girlfriend for keeps watching. I saw this earlier. You can put color over in the harvesting. <laughs> <laughs> I think it I think they're just like, you know, superimposing stuff. A lot of video editing. Probably. Alright, let's do three more counting this one. Oh Give it a hand if you don't know. That's an it reference. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny. Everybody likes Pietro. Pietro, Pietro. <laughs> Why? Because he's a clown? No. I don't like the cheap ones. Oh. They look weird. God, Lionel, same. Hey, when a firework goes off, let's shout out something random to each other. We won't be able to hear it. I'm actually shy. I overcompensate. Haha, <laughs> wasn't that so random? <laughs> that could be me sometimes. When you're, when you're shy and you're just trying not to be shy. So yeah. you end up loud, being too loud, actually. That, kind of annoying. and then also you say some like weird <laughs> yeah. thing that like makes no sense and has nothing to do. Oh yeah, I overthink literally I everything yep. I say in every conversation. Yep. Like after I, I do that around, a like, lot. Do I sound rude saying that? Do I sound stupid saying that? Usually the person you're talking to thinks nothing of it. I Just, ask my friends that all the time. I'm like, does this sound like I was like? trying to do something or right? I don't know I, like I'm just talking but I, yeah. like I don't know there's cats came, my cats refused to let us get rid of this Amazon box so it turned into their very own cat's cranny that's adorable it's the upgraded one too yeah <laughs> alright guys well I think that's uh, it for this um, that cat's gonna be a death stare right now <laughs> this pilot episode of our podcast um, hope the pilot episode. That's what you call like the first episode uh, of this uh, new TV show or something. I just didn't hear what you it's said. Like a, uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, I know so what everybody, works, sign up for it. Disney Plus. Um, go check out Frozen <laughs> Two. It's been um, like every like for the whole <laughs> video. I haven't seen Frozen Two. Uh, maybe we should watch it sometime. But see, I thought Frozen was overrated. Yeah, I think it was overrated just it was because good. of Let It Go. <laughs> yeah. That um, song like and was it's a hit like when that came out. Like, I was like, it can be looked at as a very pro feminist uh, show because she's like the princess that doesn't need rescuing. Yeah, which is cool, but people. It's basically the only Disney movie that has that. <laughs> well, that's the thing. Tangled also is that way, and oh, I yeah. actually think that's a better movie than Frozen. Um, I've never seen Tangled. So uh, it's Rapunzel. Story for yes, fun, but everybody know. knows. But it's really good. I saw it in theaters. Um, Actually, I don't know the story for Rapunzel, but but I think people put too <laughs> too much emphasis in like this in the political or the statements it makes and overrate it. Um, but that's okay. We all have opinions. Oh yeah, um, <laughs> gaming. <laughs> Disney Plus. This isn't strictly a gaming podcast. It's an everything <laughs> podcast. <laughs> It's everything podcast, then why are we picking because, gaming subreddits? Because we are a gaming channel. 
So that has to be gaming. Yeah, we, we won't only do gaming channel or gaming subreddits. The third one could be anything. We just happen to be like Animal Crossing is a good one to talk about right now because it's super popular. You well, want is the next one going to be Mario? Well, Paper Mario or Origami King? Is that going to be the next one? <laughs> so it's sold 13 million copies since March 20th as of May 15th. And that was months ago. Okay, who cares? That's a pretty big deal, dog. Okay. But Let's just end this already. That's right, you gotta go to bed. You're trying not to get in trouble. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, guys. I don't want my whole government in here. Thanks for I'm watching. watching. Um, how are we gonna sign this off? Bye. Well, that's so unoriginal. Everybody says bye. <laughs> I mean, yeah, because everybody says bye in the third of the conversation. All right, bye. guys. We'll, I don't we'll know. see you guys hopefully next week if we do it's this. It's like again. we got rid of good night and joy be with you all because. You got rid of that because you didn't like saying it all the time. You agreed to do it. Yeah. So it technically, it's a Wii thing. Because I'm trying not to be resistant to change. It's not for the Nintendo Wii. It's like us, Wii. It's not Wii, it's you. Wii you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. That's there goes you, me dropping my phone. That's what you get when you watch our podcast. You get, you know, that. Weird stuff. Um, that's what you get when you watch our YouTube channel, period. Um, so, good night, guys. Enjoy with you all. Thanks for watching. Just good night. <laughs> bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>